Drive. Hey, welcome back to my channel, Persons of a Goddess. Thank you guys for joining me today. Today is just going to be a quick message for the tribe. Make sure you hit that like and that subscribe. Any other information you need to know is down below. Send me number love, peace, and blessings whenever you receive this message. So let's see what's the vibe here whenever you receive it. Thank you, Spirit. What do we have for the tribe? Thank you, Spirit. A heartbreak. You could be going through a heartbreak. You could have just did a court cutting, or you may need to. Hmm. Some of you guys could have been finding out that you're pregnant. Maybe you don't want to be pregnant by somebody. Trap. Oh. Are you? Somebody try to trap somebody here. Okay. Somebody with a sex addiction here. Yeah, feeling like shit. Somebody's feeling like shit. Somebody could be trying to drink to get rid of the baby. What's going on? This is not going to be everybody's story, I'm guessing. Like, ooh. I made some new cards. Hope you guys like them. Let's see. This went left. I know I, I have a hard time expressing myself, but I thank you for being here for me. Oh, snap. Yeah, somebody shot up the club. Like, look at this. So their way of thinking you is to have a baby? <laughs> oh, my gosh. You could have a doctor's appointment soon. Somebody about to have a doctor's appointment, okay? Yeah, this is a trickster spirit. Somebody um, trying to trap you knowing that they weren't the one for you. Yeah, it's about to get spicy or it got spicy. It's complicated. Yeah, unicorn. Somebody, that's a unicorn. Somebody being worn here, okay? You're, you're, you're um... Your magical fountain comes with a caution sign. <laughs> I'm getting yeah, this is not somebody's um, first rodeo. Maybe this is always being done to you. People always trying to trap you. I mean, but it does take two to tangle. So yeah, somebody didn't. Somebody did this on purpose so that you won't live your best life. Okay, somebody was being shady because they want things their way. So somebody was trapping you to... Now, if this is not you, this could even be the other way around. There could be a karmic woman here trying to trap masculine to keep him around. Okay, that's what I'm getting for some. What is it? Who it is? Who is it? Who is it? Somebody that loves and hates someone. Someone who loves and hates you effed up over you. Somebody's like, I wish I would have trapped her. I love her. Secrets. They secretly love you. Drink. They secretly put something in your drink to trap you. This is bad news. Feeling like shit. This is why you was feeling bad this day that they trapped you. Some of you guys, this could have been years ago. But the secret is coming out that somebody put something in your drink to trap you. This is why you was feeling like crap. It wasn't a regular hangover. Somebody could have break you. Fed up. You gonna know? Somebody about to find out about this. <sighs> Some of you guys, this is a divine masculine that it was done to. Because, you know, women does this. Drug, drugging men, but this is to get their money. But this woman drugged divine masculine to have a baby by him. So that he can marry her. He's not going to be happy about this. You and your divine masculine have similar stories, okay? I'm really getting this here. It's like both of you guys were deceived by trickster spirits to trap you with babies so that you guys can stay in a karmic marriage, right? Or a karmic union, okay? To create karmic kids. But spirit it turned the situation around in your favor, your kids are not karmic, so okay? It's something like that. Shocking. This could be shocking to you. So although you had a baby by a karmic, your baby, your child is a demigod taking your traits or something. So what else do we have here? Jezebel's spirit was trying to take your spiritual gifts here. Jezebel's spirit was trying to act like they were you to trap divine masculine. And this is the other way around. A karmic masculine was trying to trap divine feminine by acting like a divine masculine. You guys have similar stories. Wow. This is why I'm like, who is who? Because y'all both 
went through the same thing. Yeah, you you and your twin flame and went through the same thing. Okay. This has something to do with your past. So this could have this could have been a long time ago, but you guys are about to find out that you guys have similar stories here. What is this doing in a day? Yeah, this is the truth. Your divine masculine is on his spiritual journey. He's about to send you a love message. He's also about to find out that what the woman did. That somebody was not his child. Ooh, I didn't mean to say that. So some of you guys, the divine masculine about to find out that this may not be his child. Or one of them may not be his child. Because he can have more kids with this divine feminine. I mean with this fake divine feminine so this karmic woman still trying to act like i'm still the divine feminine it's me i'm really the one for you and carmen oh your karmic masculine is doing the same thing to you still trying to portray like they're the one for you like i am listen believe me listen we had we had beautiful children together so we we must be together and it's like no that's not this is for somebody who has children, okay? That's just what it is. Closing this cycle. Okay, so you need to know this because you're closing this cycle out. You figured out a puzzle. Something was complicated. You figured a puzzle out here. That somebody was definitely lying, okay? About being your divine master because they wanted to trap you and so they drugged you and basically great you to have a baby flirting with you. I don't really think you were attracted to this Carmen masculine divine feminine. I feel like you had somewhat feelings for them, but I feel like this person was putting magic on you so that you can love them. Somebody could be biracial. Okay. Or this could be a biracial relationship for some of you guys. Yeah. It was a game to them. It was all a game to them. The weekend could be significant. A weekend turn into forever. Y'all went from flirting to having a baby because this person purposely did this. Yeah, at night. It was your birthday for some of you guys. It was your birthday or this was planned, pre-planned. You were celebrating something. So they took advantage of, oh, they're going to drink. Or they was trying to be, oh, it's your night. Let's let's celebrate or whatever this was. And y'all celebrated already right? because he was pre-planning this baby. And so was karmic woman. Smiles can change the world. You're going to be smiling about something. Yeah, y'all used to live together. Whoever this person is. Let's get lost. You lost track of time. Because you was in a daze. Because this person had you in, a, in an illusion. Now you're nourishing your soul. All right. Yeah, somebody, somebody drugged you. Yeah, it's about to get spicy with a trickster spirit because you got that snack. Period. Yeah, you wifey type and they took advantage of this. They saw you as wifey type, but you didn't see them as a wifey or a hubby. But they, they created some type of illusion where they've been drugging you so that you can fall. So if you've been feeling like every time you come to your senses, this person was putting magic on you again. They was also putting stuff in your drinks or your food. Anything else they need to know? Somebody does not want you to know this. <sighs> Something about your birthday. Somebody birthday. This was planned on your birthday. Okay. Something like that here. Um, or somebody birthday. The child's birthday. Some. Yeah. Somebody's effed up over you. And they're in regret now because their whole plan fell through because you don't want to be with them or something. You're about to receive... You or them could be receiving bad news. Some of you guys, this is your divine masculine who's about to receive bad news about somebody not being their child. I'm also getting like, this karmic cycle is over because somebody was putting a love spell on you. That's why you was going round and round with this lesson, this karmic lesson, because you was under a love spell. But now you're free. Somebody was addicted to you. Now they're being blocked. They can't put this demon, demonic spirit on you anymore, okay? Because like, they were trying to get you to be addicted to them. It's all over. It's a tower moment here because you're not interested in me anymore. So you broke a spell. You broke a love spell. And now this person feeling like shit because they're playing their work. And this is going on with your divine masculine as well, divine feminine. They are finding out the same thing that you are. Y'all are mirroring each other. Y'all going through the same similar journeys. So, yeah, y'all have a good night here.